Welcome, Sergi. Alrighty, my darlings. Let's look. It's not looking like a good week. A lot of emotional situations. You're dealing with the Queen of Cups. This person is a Scorpio. Um, lies and deception from the Scorpio. Whatever is transpiring. I'm seeing you dealing with a lot of deceptiveness. I see her stabbed in the back on the ground. Saggy, what is happening? Let's see what is happening. Let's see if you are going to be changing. Okay. I see the energy of the star and I see financial abundance is going to come in. So your week is good, but there's a lot of emotional situation and it has to do with a scorpion woman. Okay. I see everything is coming out and you're deciding to just leave the situation behind, Saggy. So, okay, let's see what is coming up. Let me um, move this. What is coming up for the Seven of Cups? So, for the Seven of Cups, I see you dealing with some hardship. Um, whatever this hardship is, I see that um, this hardship is created where there is uh, um, opportunities that there is so much and you don't know what to choose from, Okay. I see no love coming in. Um, it is not really a week for love. It is a week where there is a lot of sadness that you have to deal with, a lot of issues, a lot of situations that you're dealing with, okay? So let me just pull this down, Saggy. It is just a weird week, to be honest. The week before Christmas is just so weird, okay? So don't be alarmed, the eight of caps is that you're turning your back and there could be an issue with a child, whatever that has been happening. Um, this child has brought you in hardship. So I see you, um, you haven't stopped loving this child. This, you know, love is unconditional. Whatever is transpiring, the love for you and this child is so unconditional, but there was so much different forces, outside forces that as a, um, created issue around you and this child. I see you're, you're holding your heart for this child. You still love this child. I see you're praying um, that the lower energies be removed from this child. Okay, so whatever is happening, this child has been overcome by lower energies. And I see you're praying and this lower energy is removing from this child. The Ten of Wands is here and I see you're going to be victoriously overcoming um, an issue. You could have an issue. It's really a child that is coming up. But um, it could be that it's you and your parents. Um, you were adding some burdened issues these burdens issues are over i see you coming out on top positive news is coming in whatever the burdens i see new love is also coming in where the universe is offering you love after all the deceptiveness that has transpired you you have the holy grail of love coming in okay the energy of the star is here and I see you're going to be victoriously overcoming a deceptive situation that a scorpion person have done to you. Some of you is a scorpion, some of you is a Pisces Cancer or a scorpion, but um, you're going to be successfully overcoming this issue. Whatever is happening on Thursday, it's a yes, go ahead and do it, okay? Because you're going to be victorious and successful and whatever the deceptiveness that was going on, it's going to be over. And this is what I said, the heartbreak is now over. Um, you have overcome this deceptiveness that was transpiring. Whatever this issue and the situation is, it has to do with a Pisces cancer or scorpion woman that has done you some real injustice, okay? And you are finding out what exactly has transpired and you are moving away from this situation. There we go. I see a judgment call that is coming up for a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman, whoever this person is. I see judgment judgment call coming up on this person whatever they have done to you um definitely they're going to be paying for their karmas and i see the magician is here and the magician comes out twice so i see you regaining balance and strength in your life in this week whatever is transpire 
I see you regaining balance and strength in this week. The energy of the magician is showing up uh, the issue and the situation that was affecting you. Some of you, it could be a relationship that you were in and you're deciding um, to protect uh, um, your partner from outside influence in your relationship. You're deciding definitely to protect your partner, no matter what the cost, protect your children, your family. I see a situation with an organization and I see your victorious coming out I see that an organization had created some burdens in your life but this burden is coming to an end okay the number 10 okay a lot of people have been receiving the energy of the Empress in reverse but as I ask the universal angels and guides the Empress is going to bring you back financial stability Okay, she is opening up and bringing in love, but also financial stability. And I'm seeing you protecting yourself and your financial world from um, um, a, uh, a, um, from people and situations around you. Okay, so again, I see that this Pisces Cancer or Scorpion woman. Uh, lies and deception together you men 45 years and older could have been uh, married to this woman or is it in a relationship with this woman or it could be that this couple or these two business people had lie and deceive and now it is coming out and i see that you um suggest is going to be holding on on your money because you have seen the lies and deceptiveness of these people and whatever it is you are going to be finding balance and strength to deal with whatever is transpiring okay because there was some real deceptive situation that has transpired so let's take a look at this i see no love coming from um your partner or your child at this moment but it's okay because whatever the burdens that um, they have gotten you in. You're going to be overcoming this burden. I see really a judgment call for this lady. This lady is a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion. Whatever she did, I see that it's coming out because it has to do with your financial abundance. It could be a work situation where this person has lies and deceive you of money or you have showed them up for the lies that they have created in your life, okay? Then we see this hardship of not, um, an, an hardship of, it's as if the, 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 the tables are turned, but the energy of this outside influence is now over. I see um, the universe offering you love. This is really the energy of the universe offering you love because they saw the heartbreak, what you have been going through. You're going to be victorious and you're definitely going to be protecting your financial stability and your burdens are definitely going to be over. So there is no question in that. Whoever this person is, this person is very deceptive. This person tried to bring down your whole family um, or bring down your whole world, but they weren't, um, they weren't, um, um, accessible, um, to do that because, uh, um, outside influences and people around have seen what this person. Now, if you're a man 45 years and older, I see, um, deceptiveness in your relationship and I see you want to turn your back on on whoever this person is. Some of you are in a relationship, you men, and you um, um, realize some deceptiveness what this person has done. And now you're turning your back to this relationship and you're moving forward. Whoever this person is, it could be a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion person, you have realized what they have done. And I see you're bringing down a judgment call on this person. You're really heartbroken to see what your partner has done and however it has affected you. Now, as I said, and I've been seeing this coming up, that some of you could have had an ex-partner that was a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, and you're heartbroken because you realize that your no partner has done some deceptiveness to this person, and now you are ending a situation. Oh, my God. 
Oh my God, Sagi, I love this for you. Shine, Sagi, shine. And especially for you men, 45 years and older, whatever the issue, the situation was, whatever that was transpiring, um, let no one um, take your light away. Shine as if you are the brightest star in the sky because there are people that is just really, really deceptive and really... Um, trying to take your world from you, things that you have built up. There are people that is so deceptive. Now um, the truth is coming out. Now you found out what this person has done. Okay, so a lot of you, it could be your partner, it could be a family member, it could be your brother, whoever these people and situation is. I see um, that uh, a go to the wishing well, um, Sachi. These two cards are very, very good. Go to the wishing well. I see you have the Holy Grail and the wishing well. Now, 901 is 10. So there's a lot of 10. There's um, an end to um, hardship. A lot of 10s end to hardship. Shine as bright as you can shine, Shaji. Um, because this is an healing energy that is coming up for you, Sagittarius. You have the energy of the wishing well. And I want you guys to really look at this card and make a wish, okay? Make a wish and make a wish for yourself. Make a wish, um, a wish for something, for the, the good of humanity or for the good of yourself or for someone else. Make a wish and know that this wish will come true, whatever is transpiring. The heartbreaks are now over, Sagi. The heartbreaks are now over. And whatever the issue and the situation that was happening, and whoever has tried to deceive you in any way, you make a wish. And, you know, one of those wish that is always nice to be made is to wish for clean, clean and, and a pure heart. And what does that do? It protects you. You speak the truth all the time and the universe bless you and protect you. Okay. So let's see what else is coming out for you, Saji. All right. I see a block. Um, some of you men could be blocked, whatever the issue is, but you're outshining and you're going to be coming out. I see conflicts and a block, but the moon is here. So some of you could have a block of emotion. Some of you are so conflicting with situation that is happening around you. Um, you have the block that is coming up, whatever the issues is and the blocks that is here. A lot of you.